Members of Germany's future business elite are studying at Leipzig's Graduate School of Management, the HHL. Nicola Raba is one of those hoping that studying here will help her climb the ladder of success. Her degree program costs 25,000 euros. She's investing her savings, and her parents are making up the difference. It's worth it to me to study for another two years and be looked after, and to know there's a good chance that companies will approach me about jobs when I'm finished. These students have only been here for two months, but from the very start they notice how much companies are interested in them. They've received internship offers, mostly by management consultancies and banks. Nicola already knows that after she graduates, her starting salary is likely to be 70 or 80,000 euros a year. You invest a lot of time and money, and you really want to be sure that you'll be able to get the job you want. I think that if you choose the right university with a good reputation, everything's open to you. Maintaining its good reputation is also important for the graduate school. The more students it has, the more fees it earns. Right now there are 400 students here. The HHL is still small, with a low international profile, but the professors are building up that profile by offering things like ethics courses. Tomorrow's managers have to learn to strike a balance between profits and responsibility. What does responsibility mean? It means keeping promises. That's easy to say, but it can be a challenge. So we need to talk about things like global supply chains involving countries with widespread corrupt practices, with child labor. What does responsibility mean if you want to deal with them? James Downs has finished his degree course and is now writing his doctoral thesis. The American has been living in Leipzig for two years. He chose to study at the HHL rather than at one of the famous business schools in the United States. For someone wanting to start a business or learn about the science of what's important for starting a business, it's really hard to beat this school. It was just ranked by the Financial Times this year as the number one private business school in the world for, for entrepreneurship. Downs wants to start his own biotech company. He's currently looking for researchers and business partners. And he's certain he'll find them in Leipzig. The city is a center for medical research. James Downs wants to stay here. This year's new students are still exploring the city. Here they're on a tour focused on the history of the HHL. It all started in this building in 1898. The HHL is Germany's oldest private business school. Leipzig lies in the former East Germany, and the HHL taught business during the communist era too, focusing mainly on tourism and catering. Then the students have to get back to class. They have to invest at least 60 hours of study per week. That includes classes in the evening and weekends in the library. I would like to work in investment banking, at least for a few years, and then I'd like to have my own company. But I don't think I'd be ready for that just yet. Nicola Raba has two years before she has to make a career choice. First, she wants to do a summer internship, then spend some time studying in the United States.